up guys, Ivan said back again and I'm so ecstatic tonight because what you see here is my first ever premium format figure by Sideshow. I'm so excited, you know, uh, it's been years now since I started thinking about maybe one day uh, getting into premium formats and uh, I, I did, you know, because uh, it's the Nathan Drake um, premium format. Uh, from the game Uncharted on the PlayStation and it's my all-time favorite uh, video game with Red Dead Redemption these two games are my favorite games and uh, when I saw this I could I just couldn't uh, pass on it you know so I just uh, received it today and I'm going to open it I'm with my buddy Joel Joel say hi hi to my fellow collectors and uh, well let's open this okay hold on Oh, that's the box. I just put it upside down to show you. It shows a PlayStation and Naughty Dog logo. And my uh, statue is number 389 out of a thousand. A thousand statues only. Okay, so the box is pretty simple. There's not much to it. Again, PlayStation logo, Naughty Dog, Uncharted 3, Drake's Deception, Nathan Drake, premium for my figure. And here it has the sticker. It says PlayStation official license product. So uh, I love the box, but I have a feeling I'm gonna love what's inside even more. So bear with me. So when you open it, it has this uh, control quality control uh, sticker. So here's the box. It says Sideshow Collectibles. So let's open it. Uh, I hope it's not gonna fall. Okay, so here is the statue. So I'm gonna open this, I guess. This is a gun. This is the regular edition, not the exclusive. And I love the exclusive. It comes with this machine gun. I'm no ex expert. I don't know exactly how it's called, but you know this other um, gun that he uses in the game uh, most of the time. The problem is that when you don't live, in, when you live outside the US, like France, uh, in my case, for example, uh, you have to pay a shitload of uh, money, you know, for the uh, import, import taxes, import duties, and uh, I wasn't willing to pay that uh, that much money just for uh, an exclusive uh, gun, just for one more gun. So here's the arm. Um, Okay, here's his ring. I'll give you a closer look once the statue is assembled. Um, here is his uh, scarf. And his uh, belt and bandolier or whatever you want to call it, I don't know. Uh, with all the ammo and, and whatnot. So I guess this is the head. And it looks just like him. I'm really, really satisfied. The skin tone is perfect. The 3 o'clock shadow, beautiful. I don't know, I'm no expert, you know, I'm not a, an artist. I'm not a sculptor, I'm not a painter, but I would imagine it's easier to sculpt a, a video game character than an actual... Um, living actor I don't know because I've seen all the premium formats and I, I wasn't satisfied with the skin texture with the paint with I don't know but this is perfect this is perfect so um, let's have a look at the base looks amazing and this is the body Sorry guys, I'm holding my phone with one hand so I can give you a better look. Real clothing, the weathering is perfect. Oh shit, what is this? Okay, nothing bad. The weathering on the shoes is absolutely amazing on the boots. I mean. Okay, I'm going to assemble this. And I'll be back. Give me a second, please. 
Okay, this is uh, the base. That's under the base. Again, it says 389 out of 1,000. Beautiful. Okay, okay, okay. Closer look at his scarf. There's a wire in there. See, look. To give it a pretty much any pose you want. That's his belt. With all the ammo, look at the attention. Look at the little details. All the bullets and whatnot. I don't know, you guys might be used to this, but this being my first ever premium format, I'm freaking blown away. And here's his uh, holster. So the base, his hand is here. I guess there's a magnet in there, and there's a hole here. And um, I think there's a little uh, piece of his uh, uh, foot that goes in there. We'll see. Let me assemble this. Hold on. So I pretty much attached his gear around his body. It's still not perfect, but so yeah, this is what I was telling you about. This is this little peg that's under his foot. I couldn't find the word earlier. That's his peg. Well, look at the sole. The detail is crazy. So this bag goes in that hole, and there's a magnet in there, I guess, or in the well, in both, obviously. Look at his watch, guys. I always love this watch in all these games. Amazing. So, and this is what you get. Well, this video might be boring to you guys because. <laughs> You know, you, obviously you know what a premium format is, but I just want to film the assembly just for the record. You know, this is my first one, so uh, sorry if it's bo uh, boring, guys, but bear with me, please, till the end to uh, admire this beauty. So now I'm going to put his head on and his uh, forearm. Again, there's a magnet in there. Okay, I added the arm and uh, the head. I adjusted the belts. Here is his little pendant, his ring. I put the gun here in his ulster. The gun, sorry, what did I just say? He had a gun. And now I'm just going to add his uh, scarf. And that should be it, guys. Now, this thing is the most beautiful statue I've ever seen. I love it. Uh, it really breaks my heart because I don't have the space to, do, to put it on display right now. So it's going to go back in the box, at least for some time. But let me just give you a quick, a closer look. At the base, the sand here is beautiful. Look at this wall, all these little cracks. And uh, looks old and dusty. Look at the stones in there. This thing is fabulous. Fabulous. And then again on the back is pretty much the same. On both sides. This thing is beautiful. Again, have a look. At the souls guys they even added the little details to the things you can't even see you know when it's displayed like this when you have it in front of you look at that. the boots I mean what can I say sideshow you guys are amazing look at the little stitching the weathering on his um, on his pants really he just looks like a modern day Indiana Jones look at this pouches here and back pockets and then of course his belt that's a, a detail again you're not gonna see it but let me try and show you his uh, iconic belt buckle. Hold on. 
Can you see it? I don't know if you can. Yeah, there you go. I just love this piece. Look at the little buttons here. All these bullets. His iconic ring. Let me try and zoom and uh, focus sorry, on this thing. All the pouches. On the back as well. I'll just show you the back of the of the bandolier. The gun here in the holster. Oh, and also this part right here is so accurate. Hold on, let me show you. Look at this medallion here in the middle. All these little buckles. I don't know if it's it really feels like real uh, leather. The belt. the the face the head sculpt is just stunning i mean what can i say this is nathan drake all the way the expression i'm really glad i don't have a lazy eye a friend of mine bought it and he's got a lazy eye really 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 beautiful piece look at the pounce here i'm gonna show you the gun too the veins on his hand everything is so well sculpted I mean this thing is just crazy and this is my favorite part of the outfit his scarf guys I mean usually you know I have a few figures uh, where you can pause the cape like for example the Superman 1-6 scale Hot Toy Superman figure uh, the original one Christopher Reeve has a wire in the cape, but you, you can barely pose the cape, you know, because the wire is too thin and the cape is too heavy, but this is perfect. You can pose it any way you want, and it's just so beautiful. It's the, I love the weathering on his clothes and on his scarf. It's just out of this world, you know. It's sweaty, you know, and it's dirty, you know, like he's been walking in the desert for weeks. And I love how they, you know, the, the, the pose of the, of, the, um, of the statue, you know, and I don't know, this thing is beautiful. I'm just going to give you a size comparison compared to, oh, I also have this little thing that came with the, with the, with the video game. So yeah, this thing is so huge. Well, you can see compared to the uh, Batmobile in the back. Well, it's 1-4 scale, so... Um, anyway, guys, my first ever premium format, Nathan Drake. Uh, sorry if the video, the video was a little uh, too long and boring, but I really wanted to go in-depth and uh, show, uh, show you the assembly and whatnot. I love it, I love it, I love it. Joel, say bye. Bye. Thanks for watching guys, stay tuned for uh, another video, much love, peace, bye.